Hey, what is up, guys? It is Dragonfly Todd here coming at you with a brand new video. And today, guys, we're going to talk about the sneak peek dev blog number 14 from the Identity Developers. And first off, guys, I just wanted to make a simple remark, but a, a very important one. Um, so we were supposed to be getting a video this month, but they actually did say that they ran into some problems. They ran into some, you know, issues with the animation and of course you know those things can happen and things can get set back and we know that especially from just different things that we've experienced in this group so basically they showcase the ui for the store selling and i'll put a photo right here of that and that's like the t-shirt and whatnot and they also gave us a really cool screenshot of like a rustic looking farmhouse that's actually for sale and there's going to be a for sale sign the just the the look of this it just it, it gives me a feel you know it's it's really nice actually it's really nice um so i guess that you can obviously farm on the land it would be really cool if we could actually be able to put stuff on the outside somebody in the uh, discord was actually talking about that whenever he saw this first screenshot it'd be really cool if we could put stuff in the outside of the you know in the yard and kind of fill up that space or maybe you're just a spacious kind of person um basically they're talking about how you know the, the video is days away so obviously I'm going to you know I'm gonna to try to uh, do an analysis over that as long as it's not over the weekend um, if it's over the weekend then I don't think I'll be able to have a video up but I will try to do a very in-depth analysis if it does happen over the weekend I'll do that towards Monday or Tuesday and another thing guys I just want you to all know that that shop that I am running is still up and if you guys want to go get your little gaming gear you know keyboards backlit LED keyboards desk uh, accessories stuff like that anything that you really need to make that PC setup good is there and it's all for a low price I'm, I got some LED light strips I'm pretty sure for six dollars like that's a great price for those strips anyway back to the original video so basically I'm just really I'm really actually I'm really intrigued on how this UI system is gonna be working with the inventory and shop transactions and this is just a prototype I think this looks really good and <clears throat> I've also heard some talk about this being on Steam like whenever the town square module does release so hopefully we'll be getting some new players some new people in the community and uh, I hope that I can guide their way into the community maybe if you see my video now and you don't know anything about identity you can go out and check all of my other videos out I really go in depth in this game and honestly this game is something else so if you don't know what it is I guess you can skip past this part if you do but if you don't know what it is it's basically a role-playing game that is unlike any other like identity pretty much just takes away the boundaries between a game and actual life and I'm not talking about some weird second life crap and you know if you're if you're into that game don't don't dislike the video because I said that but man some of that stuff is weird you got like you got like actual pregnancies in there and people role-playing as dogs like that stuff is just that stuff's kind of crazy I don't know anyway if you're new to the community, I really suggest going and go ahead and uh, get on the Discord. You can uh, ask Beachball, the community manager, about pretty much anything. And honestly, guys, I'm really stoked about you know how this is gonna happen. And actually, I did notice something that's in the screenshot. It says that five T-shirts will be $155 on there. Like I'm wondering how the pricing is gonna work and how the currency is gonna be handled and whatnot. And um, that's kind of just food for thought honestly like how do you guys think that the currency is going to be working <sighs> man um i was also wondering do you think that they'll be able to have uh weed farms in these farmsteads like do you think you'll just be able to grow weed out on your front porch or out on your out in your yard and um i was also wondering what do you guys think about laws and stuff do you think that if you got weed growing out in your yard and then a cop sees it, do you think he's going to arrest you? Or how will he arrest you or do anything about it if you're offline? Could you just grow weed while you're offline and not do anything and then get back online for 15 minutes, sell the weed, and then get back offline to avoid being, you know, arrested? I'm just kind of curious on how you guys think that might work. If you guys did enjoy this video, I know it's been kind of a short one. It's it's been a kind of a, you know, just a an analysis insight type of video. 
I just kind of wanted to go over some things and go over some thoughts that I had in my head about the game and maybe even stoke some uh, or poke some uh, thoughts out of you guys. Um, if you did enjoy this video, go ahead and leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe. It's like 12 o'clock. I got school tomorrow. I got to make a video for the tube, you know, guys. Uh, also, please, 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 please go pick up some merch on the evolutiontechshop.com for my company. And it actually does have my company logo that's going to be the company that I have an identity in that as well. So if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you leave a like. Go ahead and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.